Adam Reed is a local Montreal actor, an up-and-coming rising star who can often be seen on TSN's Off the Record, giving his point of view on sports. It's the same thing as a guy who's working, who loses his job, gets a divorce, picks up a gun and shoots off the office. We are human beings. This is what happens. We just turn off sometimes, and in the heat of the moment, whether it's a cliche expression or not, that is the truth. Are, are you kidding me? Yeah. Absolutely That's how you not. Run your business? Absolutely yeah. not. You, you, you automatically sign a guy to three to five The bucks? least, the least that man deserves. What is that the all least, about? Yeah. The least what that man deserves. What have you done for me lately? Wait, wait, what, what have, have you say? done for me the lately? The least that man deserves is exactly what Paul Maurice got. He's got two years left on his contract. He's got longevity, what? and he has time. The problem with Maple Leafs is, is that there is a problem in the hierarchy of command, in the chain of command, and Ferguson doesn't have control over that team. But you know what? He needs good time. Good for Maple Leafs Sports Entertainment yeah, to recognize so that Paul Maurice and John work? Ferguson are two different yeah. people. You don't, you don't, think, he's, you don't think he's entitled to? You don't think he's entitled to a contract extension? He's I got to. I got to cut you guys off, but I, I do agree. I thought you summed that up pretty well. Francis Gardner is an award-winning third-generation rancher right here in beautiful Calgary, Alberta. And he's here with us today to talk to us about organic ranching and foods. Welcome to the show. People these days seem to have a lot of time on their hands, and what better way to spend that time in your own personal game room? On today's show, Michelle Lemire, owner of Canada Billers, right here in Montreal, Quebec, joins us to talk to us a little bit about the recent trends. Speaking of billiard tables, I had a chance of walking around here. You have a variety of pool tables. Talk to us about what kind of pool tables you have and what kind of games can people enjoy. As far as your programs are concerned, do you think they're geared more towards showing them how to cook nutritiously, or is it just about getting young people to cook? It's a little of both. We want children to cook, and we want them to think about what they're putting in their bodies. Naturally, here we make the greatest ones on the planet. I have a feeling you're not going to share your secrets with us. So, cheers. Thanks for doing cheers. this. With summer and cooking outdoors, a frequent event at your house, not everything comes directly from the grill. How about something light, cool, and fresh, yet flavorful and satisfying? How about a scrumptious restaurant-style salad? I know what you're thinking. I can't fix a salad outside. That's for the kitchen. Well, think again. We've got some wonderful restaurant-style salads all ready to go. Take a look. Before we sit down and enjoy these salads with our crew, the nice folks at Fresh Express want everyone to know that Andy, they've been making salads for 80 years. They guarantee every leaf, every bag, every day. So you know it's going to be good. Okay, let's eat. Whoa, just a second. <laughs> I'm Andy Tillis for Kitchen Spaces. And I'm Adam Reed. We'll see you next time. Okay, can we eat now? Absolutely. The terrorist next door. Yeah, Majid. There is a need in the community for a halal butcher, but the bank refused me. What do they know of halal? Adi, show me your business plan, and then I see what I can do. I do not know how to thank you, Majid. We always help our brothers. He tells me my coffee is not good. He's right. <laughs> what? I taste American. <laughs> <laughs> that bad. Cool, Mohammed. Why do you think we drink the tea? And you can do better. Rochelle Siegel, in case you haven't heard about her, is an up-and-coming interviewist. Interviewist. Yes, interviewist. That's a new word, I, I just created a new word. In all honesty, we have a lot of talent here in Montreal. Rochelle is great. And a lot of you have been downloading the videos. Keep downloading these videos because that's what makes us who we are. And again, Rochelle, what are some of the aspirations that you might have as far as interviewing? Like, what would be your ideal job of interview? Like, who would it be? Who would it be? You know what? It wouldn't be one person. It wouldn't be celebrity. It would actually be touring the world and going to talk to absolutely every different person from every different background, including you. Sorry, I was staring at your breast there for a second. I apologize. I, uh, you know, my, my mind just wanders off like that. Strip Tour 2007, the party to be at. Here we are. 2008 is going to be off the hook. 10th year edition. Be with us. One love. We'll see you. 